Ashish writes, DJ, I get stuck when I'm giving presentations. I pause and it messes up my fluency. What do I do? Here's the solution, Ashish. Don't tell anyone. Now, I hope that doesn't seem flip, but I am serious. The problem many speakers have is they forget what they're going to say next. And they have all these facial expressions or apologies. That's what people notice. They don't notice you simply pausing. Now, everybody has a momentary memory lapse from time to time. Happens to me, happens to all great speakers. Happens to bad speakers, too. Bad speakers sort of look panicked, stop, go through notes, apologize. Great speakers inwardly might be panicking, but outwardly they're thinking or they're projecting complete calm. If I forget what I'm going to say, I'll take a few steps over here and I'll look at you, at you in a reflective way, like you need a couple seconds to think about what I said because what I said was so brilliant. Inwardly, I'm thinking, what do I say next? Outwardly, I'm projecting calm and purposefulness. Do that and you don't have to worry about this other stuff. Part of being fluent when you're speaking is putting in pauses. If you finished one thought, you need a moment to reflect on the next, that's okay. Your audience needs a moment to reflect too. So don't beat yourself up. This is not a, ra this is not a six o'clock newscast where every second is money and you've got to get a new story every 15 seconds. That's not what a speech is. The other thing, don't put so much pressure on yourself to get the words exactly right. And the best tip of all, the easiest way to avoid this, have notes for yourself on a single sheet of paper that you can just glance down. That way you never put stress on your memory.